This is calculator question number 35. We're told this store averaged 75 on the first 10 ratings, and they're asking what's the lowest score they can get on their 11th rating and still be able to have an average of at least 85 for their first 20 ratings. So let's write the average of the first 20 ratings. That would be the sum of the first 20 ratings over 20. And the first 10 ratings average 75, so that's 10 times 75 is the first 10 ratings. I can treat that as if they're all 75s because that won't change the average, so it won't change the answer to the question. The 11th rating is the one we're looking for. I'm going to call that X. And we want the lowest score for X, which means we want the highest possible score for the last nine ratings for a total of 20 ratings. So those last nine scores will all be 100. So here we have the existing scores that may not have been 75, but you can treat them like they are because their average for the first 10 was 75. We have the lowest possible score, X, which means the last nine scores had to be the highest possible. And 0 to 100 inclusive means you can give them a score of 0 or you can give them a score of 100. We're including both endpoints, so we used 100, the highest possible, because that allows X to be the lowest possible. And this is the average, and we want that average to be at least 85. So if we set that equal to 85, we'll find the value of x. If I go to my calculator, and as I often do for equations that only have one variable, I'll put the left side in y1, the right side in y2. So that's 100 times 10 times 75 plus x plus 9 times 100, all divided by 20 on y1 and 85 for y2. For my window, I'm going to take x max and y max both to 100 and hit graph, and my graph looks something like this. I have a constant at 85. I have something that really looks close to constant, shallow positive slope, I'm going to exaggerate it for my left hand side. And if I use second trace, which is calculate, choice five is intersect, find the intersection. If I hit enter three times, it says the intersection is at x, equals 50, y equals 85. We knew the y value would be 85 because we specified that. So x equals 50 is the lowest possible score you can get and still receive a, an average rating of 85. I could do this by hand, multiply both sides by 20, then subtract 10 times 75 is 750 from both sides, subtract 9 times 100 is 900 from both sides, and I'll get x equals 50, the same answer. But I prefer solving equations on the calculator if I only have one variable left. Come back soon for my next video with math there's always more.